Hey, little bugs. How y'all doing? I'm just here real quick to show y'all this burger. I just got it from Uber Eats. I ordered it from a place called BGR Grill. And by the way, this is not sponsored at all. I'm just sharing. This is called the Blackened Blue. It says Cajun seasoning, sauteed mushrooms, onions, provolone cheese, blue cheese sauce, and I think it says BGR Burger. Where are we? Uh, BGR Craft Ale sauce cooked with Kraft Ale Grill sauce and served with house cut fries. I didn't want the fries. I got the side salad with some blue cheese dressing. I got my Pepsi right here, even though I got some already in my glass. I had to share my other Pepsi with my with my daughter. But I'm just showing this to y'all. You see there are no real lights. I don't have no lights going on. Just my little lamp right over there. And I'm going to see about this burger while you guys watch this next video. Hi guys, it's Tasha. If you're new to my channel, welcome to the crib. For my returning positive subscribers and subbies, welcome back. Come, oops, wake up. Come on in and get comfortable. Guys, about 11 months ago, Miss Heather Curry asked if she could see what was in these things right here. And it's 24 of them. So guess what? We're going to take a peek see and see what's in these, okay? Oh, sorry if I move you guys. I'm going to bring these a little bit closer. These four right here are not, let me readjust this camera down a little bit. And don't look at my desk, y'all. It's a hot mess. These four right here are not attached. These, uh, these over here, they're attached in a set of five. So I got, you know, the one, two, three, four, five attached, other five attached, five more attached, five more attached, like that. But these four are not. Let me take this down so this stuff won't fall. All right, let's get to it. Now this one is almost like a little catch-all. And what's in this one is Starbucks gift cards that I actually have no intention on using. I just grabbed them because I think they're cute for one. And that maybe one day I'll see somebody um do something with them on our ch on the uh, in the craft world that's uh cute and here's even one from where is this one from that's a dollar tree one is this a dollar tree one as well yeah that's a dollar tree one as well so i normally pick them up from anywhere i can find them to be totally honest so let's pick this one back this one has some cutouts c themed i got these in a swap and there you go. It has seashells and sand dollars and I think starfish are in there. And this thing I thought was just the cutest thing. So I did not want to throw it away. I want to keep it just in case I can put it on a project at some point in time. This one has cabochons. Oops, sorry about that one. This one has cabochons in it and has some um, sequence right here. I don't even know what is this. Oh, that was a charm that I got. Isn't that cute? Like I say, some cabochons. Here's some ephemera back here. Star ephemera. And this last one right here also has some blinged out cabochons and in, in I've had these so long that you see they have actually turned colors. So, so that, that's why they're still in here. I haven't used them. I just think they're cute. Like, this is too cute. Let me put that down. So, look at that. That's one that hasn't turned colors yet. And I need to figure out how I can use that. Can you? Is it focusing? I hope it is. Got some Tim Holtz stuff in here. And this little distressor. Thing right here so let's put these back and I just saw a and I didn't clean that off that's coffee my son got back there I didn't know um, I need to clean that up but I pulled these out a couple of days ago and been trying to figure out what to do with them uh, how to embellish them and Miss Tamika 
from Scrap the World uploaded a video today, so I'm gonna be watching her video today so I can I can embellish my Polaroid embellishment to make it really cute. Okay, so let's go through this one. And well, you know what? Let me start from the top. Come on, thing. Okay, here's the set of five right here. That's my little sound guy. Okay, so in this one, it's kind of like a catch-all. It has um, nail little things, but you can, I use these to put in shaker cards. It has some, at least I'm blocking the light. It has some paper clips and it has a few resin pieces in here. And I don't know what that little blue thing is for. I'm sure my son did it. So this one has paper clips, red, yellow, blue, green, and white paper clips. This one has gold paper clips uh, and some lashes. Let me take those out. Put those in the, my makeup case. This one has some pastel colored paper clips. And this one has, has the brights in there. And of course, this is when I'm making paper clips for my traveler's notebooks. Let me pull this second one out here. See, starting at the bottom. This one has words. Um, this believe right here, but weekend and I think either months. Let's see what this one says. See, now this is Monday, so it has days of the week in here, and it may have some months. I when I used to cut these out when I was doing my um, which one is that? My Target Dollar Spot planner. This one has pieces, different pieces. I want to try again to try to make embellishments so I've already cut out some things like these little small folders right here and this thing right here and different papers and some squares over there and I think it's some stars under there maybe and these ticket punches and some um what are these things these page oh I hope I'm showing y'all these page flags okay let me do this one more time Ticket punches, some squares. What's under there? I think that's just this thing right here, which was a cutout from something I bought. Another, I guess it could be a, considered a label, maybe. And these little tiny file folders. I've had that punch forever. Get to the next drawer here. I was supposed to do a Batman theme planner layout, and I just never got around to it. But that's some of the pieces from there. And here's some Josie and the Pussycats, and some characters that were they got them colored as like African American. Uh, one of those people. South Park characters and I thought that was too cute so I cut those out I still may do that don't hold me to it though but I got the pieces so why not right this one is one of my paper clips I bought this one from actually uh, Alizé Crafts and I have other pieces here other little embellishments these this one is um, crochet butterflies got some white ones and I got some cr some cream ones here there's some resin pieces in there here's a little cake a little resin heart cake and there's some more butterflies over there they're under there the paper ones so that's what's in that one and I have to be sure and brace up on these so they'll slide in properly. Let's see, I can leave that one right there. See, this one has some stars. That's there's some pieces. There are some bowls. This is some stars and arrows in there, uh, punched from gold and bronze paper. Here's some hearts right here. 
some plain solid color hearts and some shimmery gold hearts and this is just um this was given to me from a friend and it's actually a thumb drive or whatever you want to call it and it never worked and he I asked him if I could have it anyway because I thought it was cute so that's in there and those are just some 19 what was that 96 I think or whenever the Olympics was here that's that's what that is a couple of those back there so we're done with that one let's put this one back This one next. Now, this one has my blades, and I need to put these in my makeup kit. But this is for my brows. This is my dollar from the Bahamas, and these are those Target Dollar Spot um, pockets. Okay, sorry about the interruption. In this next one, I have some chain and I was supposed to be using to make some uh, jewelry with not necessarily jewelry um, and I gotta stop saying um, to make some dangles with this is a I was uh, making a shaker or something this is one of my first ones so I said okay that's kinda cute I'll keep it and just um, those little two pieces in a memory card for my old camera. This one has paper clips that I've made. I've made some bows like this right here. Oops. Some bows and I made paper clip with bows and this was some this was some stickers and I was able to make paper clips out of those. So I got those in there. The, the next coffee themed planner I make those will probably go in there this one is kind of like a, another catch all my daughter's cash card there, there are some binder clips in there and there's that ring that I purchased before that one that I was supposed to make a big bow and put that in got a silver quarter in here a couple of regular quarters and a Kennedy hair. So just keep that in there. For right now until I can find some place else to put it. And this is another catch all. Um, as you can see just the um, card reader. Some uh, what are these things? I got these at Target and then I punched out that scallop punch and put those stickers on there. And that's a bracelet that I've been here forever and I just found okay and the very last one come here okay so this very last one we can we have okay in the bottom one down here um some Starbucks little emblems for when I make more of the paper clips these ladies right here I found those images online and printed them out and I stuck them in one of my DIY projects this was a chain I mean a chain it was a ch like a charm and it, it broke right there and I just hadn't put nothing else on it I got this in a swap and I just thought it was cute I just and I keep it. I just, I just, I keep too much stuff probably. But that's so cute. I couldn't, I couldn't dare to part with it. I got these little miniature doilies here, and some more pieces that I had cut out. Let me put this in there for right now. Right here is some trim that I bought from the Scrapbook Expo. Some silver and some gold trim. These are pin refills for the diamond top pins and some uh, a few pieces of bling. Is there anything else up under there? Yeah, just some paper clips. Alright, next are 
the tassels. And these are just different color tassels. Gray, pink, purple, turquoise, and the other colors. And it, it was black. And I had more. There's a white one. There somewhere. But that's the majority of them right there. Of those small ones anyway. And I remember picking those up at Office Depot. This is just a box of different color. A box up, I'm sorry. A drawer of different color binder clips in different sizes. And in this last drawer is Uptown Chic's little planner dangles. I got three of those. And it's an actual functional little notepad. So I have, like I said, I have three of those. I don't know why those keys are in there. And I have two of these things. And these two are, are um, thumb drives, jump drives, whatever you want to call them. And that is it. So, guys, I know it's been a long time coming, but there it is. Those are the items that I have in my Dollar Tree organization, whatever you want to call it. So that's it. I want to thank you guys so much for taking time out of your day to watch this video. If you haven't, I would greatly appreciate it if you would subscribe to my channel. Also, if you like this video, please give it a thumbs up. Uh, all your tr comments, I truly appreciate it. Come back anytime and I'll see you all in my next video. Bye bye, love bugs.